So hey, welcome back to DV Tech. So you're back with a new video. So in my previous video, I told you how to install Fedora OS on your PC. So in this video, we're going to be seeing five best Android OS to be installing in your PC. So if you're new to this channel, please do subscribe to the channel for more technical and interesting videos. So let's go ahead and quickly get into the video. So as I told you in the intro, we're going to be seeing five different OS to install in your PC, Android OS to install in your PC. So in our list, Fido OS stands in the fifth position. So when I tell you Fido OS, you must be thinking, why is it in the first position? I'll let you know. So as you all know, Fido OS is in Chinese based or Chinese focused OS to install. And it also doesn't have a Play Store. So you need to be installing any third party app to install your Android apps on your device like App or any other stores to download your Android apps. Or it also has a market where you can download Android apps, which is already given in it. If you want to install any other different apps, you could go with the third party apps to install third party stores to install the apps and sadly it's a 32 bit software so this isn't a 64 bit software so it is 32 so you could run with the intel processor smoothly so without thinking you could install this if you're interested but this is in the first position so wait for the first position let us see which stands in the first position so let's all wait and quickly see which is in the next position so in our list, we have the open thoughts in the fourth position. So what is the open thoughts? So it is an Android based OS. So in this OS, it supports the Windows, Linux as well as the Android apps. So it sounds very cool, right? So this is a 64 based OS and also it supports all types of softwares where you can run it smoothly. But if you're using Android for the first time in your computer, this might be a bit difficult to use. So if you want more easier OS, I'll let you know which OS to download. But one disadvantage is you don't have Play Store. So what to do when you don't have Play Store? What you need to do is go to the third party websites to install the apps. But it supports all and it also works simultaneously. So it can even run Windows as well as Android and Linux. So very cool, right? So this stands in the fourth position that is OpenTOS OS. And also it has got a lot of features compared to the other Android OS. This OpenTOS OS has got a lot of features. So if you want to just have a look at the OS, I'll just be adding some preview in the next slide because uh, some previews may be having copyright issues, but I'll try my level best to add the preview. So if you're using for the first time, I recommend you a different OS. But now if you wanted to have cool features with supporting all the software, First, you can go with the open toss. So this stands the fourth position. So let us see which is in the third position. So now let us see which stands the third position. So that is the Phoenix OS. Sounds very cool, right? So Phoenix OS. So now coming to the Phoenix OS, it supports the 86 uh, based software and also the all Android apps. So this is a quite common or quite popular OS to install. So it supports all. If you're a gamer, you could use this software to download all your games and Android apps in this software. So the speciality of this software, it is available in the 86 as well as the 64 bit. So it can run the both. So some software comes only with the 64 or with the 86. So 86 is nothing but the 32 bit and the 64 bit. So some software only comes with the 32 and some comes with the 64. But this Phoenix OS comes with the both. That is 64 and 32. Sounds cool, right? and next thing this feature is for especially for the gamers so if you want to stream games and if you want to stream any other apps or some some interesting games in the youtube you could go with this OS. so it has got a lot of features in it and if you're looking for the best standard OS with a lot of features you could go for the phoenix without thinking so this stands in the third position so now let's quickly see which stands in the second position so the OS which stands in the second position is the Prime OS. So one of the coolest OS that I could personally tell because I have installed the Prime OS in my device and it still works smoothly. So if you're struggling to optimize your PC, you could install this Prime OS because especially this might be very good for the gamers to stream. And also it has got a lot of features so it might this OS isn't complicated so as you can see some Android OS might be very complicated to use but this OS looks like a Windows but it supports all the Android apps in it and also it looks like a Windows where you can use the Windows or you even have the drives to use so this might be very simple to use so if you want a simple and a good feature one you could go with the Prime OS so that is the reason why it is in the second position and also this comes with the both the variants that is 32 bit and 64 bit so moreover I got one of the best advantage in this uh, OS guess what it has a dual boot option. So some people might be wanting a Windows as well as Android to run in my system. So with this Prime OS, you could install the boot. That is the dual boot. So this is the feature, this is the speciality which is given in the Prime OS. So now let's go ahead and quickly see which stands in the first position. So the wait is over. So let's quickly see which stands in the first position. So coming to the first position, that is the blue stacks. So most commonly used OS, not OS, but a simulator. So what is simulator? Nothing but a Android engine to use or which is installed in your PC. So you didn't need to boot your device to install BlueStacks. All you need to do is open Google Chrome and type download BlueStacks and you will get the first official link to download the BlueStacks. 
So once you download, you could rock it. I'll tell you why. Because it is most common Android simulator which is used in almost all the devices. When you go with any apps, most of them prefer uh, BlueStacks. I'll tell you because it has got all compatible softwares and apps to install, all compatible Android apps to install in this BlueStacks. And also it has got so many features to add. So it has got all the navigation by, it has got all the apps to install and also you can run PUBG. So the most frequently asked question is that I want to install PUBG, how do I do that? So it is very simple. All you need to do is open Google Chrome and type download BlueStacks. So you'll get the first official link to download. So you just need to enter the official website and click on download. And you need to really have some patience to get installed. So once you install the software, it is compatible with all Android apps and you can go easily go to the Play Store and click on download PUBG. So once it is done, you could easily play the game or stream the game. So this is the common software which is used to stream the game and it is not very difficult to use. It is very simple. It is not that complicated. It is very simple. That's the reason it is top one rated simulator for the Android. So if you want to try downloading this, I'll be giving you the OS download links in the description. You just go there and click on download. That's very simple. You could do it. So and this doesn't need any booting software to download. This is just an app where you need to install using your Windows. So sounds very interesting, right? So if this video was helpful, please give the video a thumbs up, hit the like and subscribe button, suggest us what to do in the next video. Until this, stay tuned to the Vishwas from DV Techies.